basically it's an event where we invite the community as well as UNT to bring their dogs out for a day in our backyard. Yeah. And um, it's it's a way to get the community together as well as people who don't have dogs or who don't get to see dogs on a regular basis. It's also a great way to interact with other people and it's a great way to get involved with the Den Animal Support Foundation. For the first semester we didn't inv involve food but the second semester we sort of made it into like a tailgate style event so the, f the, dog, the, the event was for the dogs but the people also had something to go for which was the food and the music. And well as far as uh, money is concerned we've raised Including uh, hours donated, we've probably told about 1500 um, With such a simple event, that's a significant amount of money. I think it's been so successful just because of the fact that girls love dogs, people love dogs, and dogs love dogs. I like Toss and Paws because it's a unique philanthropy event. It's not like many other, including the ones that we do, because it's not competition based. So all the stress that builds up before the event, everybody can just hang out when they're at Toss and Paws. There's food, there's dogs. It's just a lot of fun for people to be able to hang out, support a good cause, eat not bad food, uh, and spend some time with some dogs. I like Tiles and Paws because dogs get to interact with other dogs and people get to come out and have fun and dogs usually make people feel a lot happier and plus the money goes to the Din Animal Shelter which is helping dogs like that are there that can't get adopted and that really need someone to adopt them and it's just a really good thing to do. I like Toss and Paws because dogs are fuzzy and they're nice and they're really cool to play with and I enjoy dogs better than cats because I hate cats.